You're tuning into Black and White Sports on YouTube. The no holds barred truth on sports. The main event starts now. Black and White Sports fans, let's talk about NBA Hall of Famer Scottie Pippen, sixth time champion of the Chicago Bulls. Now, we've done many videos on Scottie Pippen because he has been trashing everybody, including former teammate Charles Barkley when he was with the Rockets and also the greatest of all time, Michael Jordan. And yet again, guys, Scottie Pippen is throwing Michael Jordan under the bus. I mean, Scottie Pippen must be very, very desperate for money. And we know he's saying all this stuff to sell books, but he is burning a whole bunch of bridges. Now, Michael Jordan, we haven't heard him actually say anything about the book. Everything that he had to say was in um, in the last dance. But I'm wondering, though, what Michael Jordan actually has to say about Scottie Pippen's book, Unguarded, because what we're going to be talking about in this video probably is the most insane thing that Scottie Pippen has yet said. So we're going to be diving into that in this video, guys. First, make sure you, sure you guys go over to blackandwhitenetwork.com. Memberships are, av are available over there as well as free content over there as well. Also, you can shop for the merch. If you hit the uh, the shop tab, it will take you to the merch. Let's get rid of the ad there. And we're going to give you 15% off through Black Friday if you use the discount code THANKFUL in honor of Thanksgiving, guys. So with that being said, let's get into this. Scotty Pippen says Michael Jordan ruined basketball in new book. I'm going to repeat that again, guys. Scotty Pippen says Michael Jordan ruined basketball in new book. I mean, the man that made basketball a global sport. Scotty Pippen said that Michael Jordan ruined the game of basketball. Unbelievable, guys. But let's go ahead. Let's read this here. Scotty Pippen put forth his version of, quote, The Last Dance. Pippen, who recently released a book called Unguarded, went after former teammate and NBA icon Michael Jordan, saying that he ruined the game of basketball in an excerpt from the book, which was shared by Hype Beast. Quote, and this is the ridiculous stuff that uh, Scotty Pippen said here. He said, quote, I may go as far to say Mike ruined basketball, Pippen said. In the 1980s on the playgrounds, you'd have everyone moving the ball around, passing to help the team. That stopped in the 90s. Kids wanted to be like Mike. Well, Mike didn't want to pass, didn't want to rebound or defend the best player. He wanted everything done for him. Quote, that's why I always believe LeBron James was the greatest player this game has ever seen. He does everything and embodies what the game is truly about. Unreal guys. So he's trying to elevate LaChina James by disrespecting Michael Jordan. So he said that Michael Jordan didn't want to pass didn't want to rebound or defend the best player. Now, ladies and gentlemen here, I'm going to throw you some stats here. OK, Michael Jordan here, believe it or not, because remember in the 90s, they, people used to say Pippen has his all around game. But Michael Jordan, for his career, folks, averaged 5.3 assists per game. Guess what? That is more assists per game than Scott Pippen. Very close, but Scottie Pippen averaged 5.2 assists per game to MJ's 5.3 assists per game. And by the way, folks, defense defensively, Michael Jordan was a better defensive player than Scottie Pippen. Michael Jordan did actually win defensive player of the year. Scottie Pippen. No, it did not happen. Now, I will give uh, Scottie Pippen credit on this 1991 NBA Finals. The Bulls lost game one and then the series changed around and the Bulls won four games to one when Phil Jackson decided to put Scottie Pippen on Magic Johnson and the Bulls ran off four straight games to win their first NBA title. However, Scottie Pippen is just so jealous. Michael Jordan is the GOAT. Michael Jordan was the best player on all of those teams. And no matter what Scottie Pippen says, 
he was a clear number two. He was a great player. He he was an all time great player. He was on the top 50 list. He made the top 75 list. And there's some people out there, folks, honestly, that truly believe that Scottie Pippen would not be on the top 50 or top 75 list without Michael Jordan. But he is on that list. But Scottie Pippen, man, is just so salty. And he wants to say that LeBron James is the best player of all time to to pretty much diminish Michael Jordan, even though Michael Jordan never had a moment ever like LeBron James did in the 2011 NBA Finals against Dallas Mavericks when he just went M.I.A. M.I.A. Now, people are going to say, well, Michael Jordan lost to the Celtics. Yeah, the Celtics were all time great players. And that was uh, prior to Scottie Pippen. But nobody ever accused Michael Jordan of being afraid of the moment during that time, because remember, he dropped a 63 on the Celtics. They lost that game. They lost that series. But nobody slammed him for quitting and being scared of the moment. LeBron James was petrified in the 2011 NBA Finals. That has never, ever happened to Michael Jordan. So for him to say that Michael Jordan ruined the game of basketball, he made the game a global sport. Remember 1992 uh, Dream Team pretty much, you know, changed basketball forever. And David Stern had a lot to also do with that in the 80s. He started prioritizing, pushing the individual players. And when Michael Jordan came, it changed the game because in the 1980s, folks, early 1980s, baseball was still the go to sport for many young kids. It was for me. I grew up playing baseball, not basketball. All of my friends, we were playing baseball. Michael Jordan changed everything. Scottie Pippen, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, man, that you have to be this petty. It's absolutely pathetic, you know, that he has to stoop to this level here to try to sell a book. He wants to elevate LeBron James by diminishing Michael Jordan. This is completely petty. So petty, guys. And what he said makes absolutely no sense. Michael Jordan was an all time great defender. He didn't stop you from winning defensive player of the year. Guess what? You never did. Michael Jordan didn't stop you from winning. Uh, finals MVP. Guess what? You never got one because Michael Jordan was just that dominant. And you had your moment to actually lead the Bulls somewhere. You didn't get to the finals. And the next season after Michael Jordan had left, he came back. The Bulls weren't that good. And you were the guy. Michael Jordan came back. They didn't win the title, but the Bulls definitely did get better. But that's just my thoughts on this. What do you guys think of this? Black and white sports fans, Scottie Pippen saying that Michael Jordan ruined the game of basketball. This is completely, completely idiotic. Anyway, guys, let us know what you think about all this in the comments. Make sure to subscribe to Black and White Sports. And we'll catch you next time. Thanks for watching the show. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Be sure to tune in next time on Black and White Sports.